Our mission at Swiss TPH is simple, to make the world a healthier place. Founded in 1943, Swiss TPH has grown considerably over the past eight years in an ever-globalized world. Moving into our new headquarters, Belo Horizonte, allows us to come together under one roof, together working on the most pressing global health challenges. One of our goals at Swiss TPH is to take science to impact. And an example of this is the work that we've been doing funded by the Swiss government in partnership with the government of Tanzania. Here we've been strengthening health systems and a part of that has been transforming policy and providing guidance to ensure the institutionalization of structures to empower people to take control over their own health. My research has taken me from Ghana and South Africa to Tanzania, to Brazil and to the country of Georgia. In all of these places, I've had the pleasure of collaborating in unique cultural settings. Our research ranges from assessing health risk of urban agriculture, to monitoring epidemics of bacterial meningitis, and studying the development of antibiotic resistance in tuberculosis. Our aim is to deepen the understanding of infectious and non-communicable diseases, environment, society and health, health systems and interventions to improve people's health and well-being all over the world. My work focuses on migration health and public involvement. And this is important because migrants are vulnerable population and they need to be empowered to get access to the health system through engagement, participation. I'm a Syrian refugee and epidemiology master's student. For me, Swiss TPH is more than a place to study. It's where I have the chance to apply scientific knowledge to enhance population's health. And it's where I have formed valuable relationships with people from all over the globe. We offer more than 50 national and international training programs and courses at graduate, postgraduate and doctoral level. For me, it is very important that our students from over 80 nations feel supported in their academic and daily life. We have researchers from all over the globe studying infectious and non-communicable diseases, using methods ranging from anthropology and social sciences to biostatistics and observational cohorts with biobanks. We have a unique set of experts in disease modeling, health economic, epidemiology and more. Together with our local partners, we co-create plans to prioritize the most impactful intervention to fight diseases such as malaria and other tropical diseases in countries around the globe. It's very exciting doing PhD in a such a modern working environment. Working all together under one roof really enhances opportunities to meet colleagues and experts from all around the world. Our new place of work is a dynamic life science and biotech hub with research institutes, startups and private companies that offers new opportunities for collaboration. Right now we are in our BSL3 lab which has been built using an innovative technology that allows us to work with different pathogens such as MTB, a causative agent of tuberculosis in the safest way of possible. Within the lab, we also have the opportunity to study many neglected tropical diseases such as Buruli ulcer and Chagas. The issues of our 21st century are global issues that can only be tackled in partnerships, as we have seen with the COVID-19 crisis. Swiss TPH has built over many years these kind of networks in the field of public health, and that's why I like to work here, because we work in these partnerships following our research trajectory from innovation through application to really working with the people in the field to get it implemented in the context where it's needed. We offer services in tropical medicine and clinical research for development of diagnostics, drugs and vaccines. My work in particular involves clinical trials for malaria and parasitic worms 
to provide new innovative treatments to improve patients' health. At the heart of Swiss TBH is the spirit of partnership. Together, we can make the world a healthier place.